Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. My name is Maria. Thank you guys so much for coming back. So I was having a little problem. I did order a new bed for my room and I am going to be taking it up all these stairs, but I did have a little problem with Amazon. So I ordered my bed, which was the headboard and the bottom frame. And this was the only box that arrived. When it got here, I was kind of like, huh, maybe it might be because I don't know why it would be that small. But after I opened it, this is how my room looks. By the way, I did get rid of my other bed frame ahead of time. So I did call them. I told them that this was the only box that I got. And they were going to be sending me a new headboard the last minute they said send this one back we're going to send you a whole new one so then it was another extra week that i had to wait on top of the first two weeks that i had already waited and then same thing happened i got the exact same box that i'm opening right now which was only the bottom bed frame so finally like a month later i got the headboard and you guys can see right here that it's a little bit ripped but as long as it's not damaged i thought i was like okay it doesn't matter here's the headboard there was nothing wrong with it i was so happy when i opened up the, the box and i looked at it i was like finally i can make my bed so here we are me and amberly we're going to be moving the stuff out of the way and she's gonna help me make my bed i have never ever in my life done a whole bed i had to help my husband like put some screws in after he told me what when where so yeah <laughs> this is gonna this actually took me a while so um this is what we're going to be doing for a little bit girl was doing behind my back while I was over there being a hard worker <laughs> doing my bed whoever saw this put an emoji and I will shout you out on my comments down below If you guys thought that me and Amberly were working building that bed so calmly, nope. <laughs> Here's Ruby and Andrew. This is what they were doing the whole time that we were over there building that bed. And of course, mom life, right? They were so upset that they weren't gonna have this light after we put our mattresses together. <laughs> but yeah, this was so fun to them. They thought that it was a huge light in my room and it was gonna stay there.
my bed's almost done i did go ahead already and put the metal support right there and now all i need to put are those wood metal slacks that you guys see over there they just need one screw on each side so i'm just screwing them in and of course i am going to be finishing doing my bed um i wanted to show you guys these pillowcases that i got from walmart they were only 3.99 and they are so soft as they say right there soft microfiber and also this one microfiber sheet set king size bed and what i loved about it was that they're bleach friendly they were only 17.99 and of course i am going to be taking off the stain i had dropped some coffee here on my carpet and so I'm going to be using my carpet cleaner that my mom got me as a housewarming gift. And I love this carpet cleaner. I would suggest if you guys are looking for a carpet cleaner to buy this one. I will leave the link for you guys down on the bottom. And I also have a tutorial. I will link that video for you guys also right next to that carpet cleaner link. <music> I got a new little friend I got this shark um, it's a robot carpet cleaner so I will leave the link for you guys on the bottom but the kids actually named it baby shark so I needed to name it something because I can go and tell Google to turn it on for me so yeah that's his name baby shark this thing is amazing i don't have to spend time on passing the vacuum now that i am a working mom so i am a working mom and i do have four kids so that vacuum just makes my life so much easier and i really really love it i also love that it's got the bin to throw the trash by itself and then it goes back to do whatever else it needs to do so here it is as you guys can see i'm folding a bunch of clothes and it's just cleaning my carpets To clean my dresser and everything in my room I'm going to be using Method and it's the glass cleaner and the pink one is Smell. It's so delicious. It's honey crisp apple and I love using Method and also Mrs. Myers for everything in my house. Their scents are so good 
And if you guys haven't tried them, definitely go check them out. They have new scents for Thanksgiving and Christmas. And if you guys use my link, you guys will get a couple free gifts. So definitely go check it out. It's for sure worth it. So check them out and let me know how you guys like them. As you guys can see my bench is really dirty this is usually where i change andrew's diaper when he comes out the shower i just lay him here and i also always change his clothes here and he always steps on this to get up on my bed so i am just going to be going over it with my carpet cleaner using this waverly chalk paint i'm going to be painting my mirror because i feel like it looks too dark so yeah i'm just going to be painting it and leaving some of the brown sticking out a little bit and I will show you guys how it looks in the end. Now going into my restroom, don't get scared guys, I do have a huge mess, I haven't been able to clean my restroom in a while, so yeah, I have a huge mess. <laughs> I'm going to be cleaning my whole restroom and I have a lot of stuff to take downstairs to the laundry room, so I'm also going to be washing, but I'm letting you guys know that it is a big mess. So look at this, the carpets, the sink, everything is really messy, dirty, so I'm going to get it all done today. I have a question. What is your least favorite chore to do? Mine is folding clothes. It is the worst chore ever because I feel like it's endless. As you guys can see i was not messing around look at all this stuff all over my vanity so yeah that's all makeup foundation hair everything so that's what i'm going to be wiping off right now and of course i am using some clorox wipes because i love these to get rid of the bacteria so that's what i'm using right here to wipe everything down and on the other counter that's exactly what i used too
And now this counter got dirty again, so I'm just going to be getting rid of all this. It's practically all trash, stuff that I didn't need on my vanity. So I'm just going to be putting it all in a bag in the trash and going to wipe this down again. If you guys have seen any of my other videos, you guys will realize that I took my ironing board out of my room and put it here on this little area here because I kind of feel like um, it would probably be better out in the hall so that everyone can just use it out here. And this is just how it looks coming into my bedroom all nice and bright because I have all the windows open. But when I don't have my windows open, this is how it looks. I wanted to dip it down for you guys a little bit so you can see a little bit better. So I hope that you guys like the new headboard and of course my bed and the blanket over the chair. 
isn't all made up anymore because Andrew and Ruby were jumping all over my room and I was like, Ugh, I give up. <laughs> I am not going to do it all over again. But yes, this is how my room looks and my restroom is all nice and clean finally. And it looks all shiny and bright. Hopefully it stays like this for a little bit longer. And I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, please make sure to give me a thumbs up. The thumbs up just helped me know if you guys like this video and for me to do more of these types of videos. And I hope that you guys are already subscribed. And thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.